सो वेलकम बैक टू द ड्राइवर्स हब वी आर हेयर एट जे के एन आर सी राउंड टू ओवर हेयर एट करी मोटर स्पीड वे एंड वी हैव अटल बिट ऑफ अ स्पेशल फीचर फॉर यूर दिस ओवर हेयर इज द एल जी बी एफ फोर कार विच द रेस ओवर हेयर यूज टू रेस ऑन द रेस ट्रैक एंड आई एम गो गिव यू अ फुल कम्प्लीट वॉक अराउंड Powers the Formula 4 LGB car. Well, it's a 1.3 liter uh, naturally aspirated engine which was sourced from a Suzuki Swift. It's a G13V engine, produces anywhere between 90 to 100 horsepower. Uh, this is a spec series of racing, so you can't do too many modifications to the engine. So all of the cars pretty much have the same power levels and everything to keep the racing competitive. Moreover, you can't even change the tune because this thing is equipped with a racing ECU. and it's given to the teams by the FMSCI and it's locked from the factory so you can't do any sort of tune change so that the racing stays level and competitive the engine is mounted in the middle of the car as most racing open wheel category cars are and it's mated to a 5 speed manual gearbox which is inside the cockpit so uh, there are two different classes in the LGB formula 4 uh, series over here at JKNRC there's the pro class and the novice class so There's the pro class and the novice class. So this over here is a pro car, and there's one way of distinguishing the two. It's and that is with the, and that is with the suspension setup. So the suspension setup over here is a bit different. The suspension springs and everything are in board over here underneath is the uh, fiberglass shell over here. Whereas in the novice car, it's outside, and you can see the springs on the outside. Of course, you have some JK tire rubber on this. Which will give you good amounts of grip, and and for all of you tuner boys, these are some sick-looking Team Dynamic racing rims. So this is where you can see the recognizable side pod, which most Formula cars have, except for the Mercedes AMG Formula car this year. But yeah, this is where it's the most recognizable that it's a Formula car. You have all of your cooling system and everything lost over here. Lost over here. Lodged over here inside the side pod. So all of your cooling system and everything you need to cool, keep the car cool is lodged over here inside the side pod. And some more things over here is that you have the external ignition switch. So if something bad happens, you can just the marshals on the side of the track can just flip the switch to turn the car off and make sure nothing. Bones or something like that. So, let's head into the cockpit. super cramped over here on the inside you basically have scaffolding roll bars and everything over here you of course have a harness type seat belt the steering wheel is super small because the ratio and everything on the steering wheel is for a race car so it's only lock to lock then the gear shifter is right over here beside your left leg five speed manual and you have barely any space to shift i don't know how these drivers do it while down shifting and braking uh, the clutch itself it's super hard super hard like it's very tough to press it in and of course you have three pedals since it is a manual transmission a very special place to sit about the LGB formula 4 car is that it's completely locally produced and manufactured everything from the chassis roll over protection bar 
to the even the suspension and of course the tires which have been provided by JK Tires it's completely Indianized it's made over here in India and that's the coolest thing about this car because it's our homegrown race car and it's very exciting to see all of the young talent over here fighting it out onto the racetrack for their glory. A big thank you to M Sport and our boy Vignesh for letting us uh, come over here and check out their garage and their cool cars. Uh, a big shout out to JK Tires Motorsport for calling us out for this weekend and I'll catch you in another one.